Welcome back to Solid Cam Pro. In this exercise, we are going to create this 3D model. Here we have the front view, and uh, we have here two circles. The outer circle is 60 millimeter in diameter, and the inner circle is 44 millimeter in diameter. And this part is uh, 80 millimeter from here to here. This radius here, 3 millimeter and this one is 3 millimeter you can see here times 2 1 2 and here we have this gap 6 millimeter this one and this gap and this gap is 12 millimeter this one is 12 millimeter and this one is 12 millimeter and here on the right on the right view you can see uh, this part is extruded 52 millimeter and you can see this this one six millimeter and we have two holes this one and this one two hole diameter 16 through hole and the radius of this one is 18 millimeter the same to this one 18 millimeter you can see here radius 18 millimeter times four we have one two three four and on the top view here you can see we have two hole this one and this one two hole diameter 10 and through all the distance from here to here 12 millimeter from the outer line to the center 12 millimeter the same for this hole and on the left view you can see this part extruded 36 millimeter symmetric so let's start to create our model draw two circle one two define 60 millimeter and this one 44 millimeter draw a rectangle and here draw two more rectangle one two define from here to here 3 millimeter and from here to here 3 millimeter 8 millimeter 8 millimeter from the outer line to the center 54 millimeter and this one 18 millimeter from the outer line to the center 35 millimeter select horizontal constraint midpoint is center select trim command trim this line delete this line this one 22mm draw a rectangle draw another rectangle 
select vertical constraint midpoint to the center the same this one define 36 millimeter Twelve millimeter. Select this one again. From the outer line to the center, sixty-five millimeter. From here to here, thirty-three millimeter. Select trim command. Trim this line too. Select line. Define eight millimeter draw a line on the center, convert the line to construction line, select mirror, select this line, this line, this line, and this line, and this line. Finish a sketch. Select extrude command. Select this part. 52 millimeter. Symmetric. Select this part and this part. 36 millimeter. Select this one. 6 mm okay. and now we are going to apply some fillet 18 mm okay. select fillet again 6 mm Select this and this three millimeter. And now we are going to apply some hole. Select hole command and select this outer edge. Select this one and select this outer edge. Let's change to 10 millimeter here. Select this one from here 12 millimeter and from here 12 millimeter. Millimeter, twelve millimeter. You see, this hole started from here and ended here. And now we are going to add some chamfer. As you see here. This we have uh, 0 0.5 millimeter chamfer here. 
and you can see here times four we have this side this side and this side and this side select chamfer select this Like this one, zero point five. Apply the same here. You can see here we have this jumper zero point two times four. We have this one and this one. We have two holes here, and we have two holes here. Select chamfer, select this, and this, and this one, 0 0.2, apply. Let's apply color, select this metal, this one looks fine, So this is how we created a simple 3D model in Inventor. I hope you like it. Don't forget to share and like our video. Please subscribe to our channel for more projects and more video in Inventor. And thank you for watching.